Are you buying a pre-owned MacBook? I'll show you how to test everything you need to make sure you're not buying a damaged, broken, or stolen MacBook. I'm Austin Trigley and I'm at this beautiful Moraine Lake in Banff National Park. To learn more about flipping locally on social marketplaces, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified every week when I upload a new video. If you want to make sure you don't get burned when you're buying a used MacBook, I'll show you how to test everything you need without opening the computer in just a few minutes. I've flipped hundreds of MacBooks and I've seen everything from broken, stolen MacBooks to faulty screens with dead pixels and outlets that don't work. I've learned how to protect myself so I know I'm buying a legitimate, fully functioning MacBooks and now I'm here to teach you everything I've learned. I've got a free seven step cheat sheet that you can download below. It'll walk you through the entire process and provide templates and examples of everything you need to know to buy, market, and sell your MacBook. All while avoiding scammers, saving time, and creating the best ads possible. Step number one, security protocol. First, make sure they tell you the password and you log in with it so you know it's correct. Second, you're going to want to check iCloud and make sure there's no iCloud logged in and there's nothing associated with the account. This is a good way to check that it's not stolen. Third is the root password. Go to directory utility and make sure there is no root user enabled. Next, remote management. This makes sure there's no company that has control of the computer. Go to System Preferences, then Sharing. Lastly, Touch ID. This is only on the new Touch Bar models, but make sure it works and make sure there's no saved fingerprints. Step number two, double check the details. Do a spec check. Make sure the year, model, hard drive, RAM, processor, and everything else matches up with what the original ad was listed. Copy and paste the serial number and go to Apple's website to check the warranty and make sure it has a valid purchase date. Step numero trace, hardware test. Connect to Wi-Fi and pull up YouTube. We're going to be checking the screen. Type in full color screen test. Move the MacBook around different angles, adjust the brightness, and make sure there's no dead pixels, physical scratches, cloudy discoloration, or lines in the screen. Next, pull up a different video that has sound. Adjust the sound up and down and make sure the speakers work. Test all keys on the touch bar and the touchpad to make sure that everything works and there's nothing that's stuck or that's not functioning. Next, plug in the charger to all outlets. Make sure there's nothing that's not working. Test the USB, SD, in all slots possible. Make sure that the battery isn't loud. If you're turning on the computer, it shouldn't be overheating within the first two minutes. Lastly, test the webcam. Open up the FaceTime app and smile at your beautiful face. <laughs> Step number four, software test. Check the Bluetooth. Open up Bluetooth in system preferences. Turn on your phone and make sure that it's finding the Bluetooth device. The next thing we can do is to run a diagnostic. Turn off the computer and when you're restarting it, hold down the D key. This will start a two to three minute diagnostic that will check everything on the inside of it. Step number five, does it pass the test? Use your judgment and intuition about the situation. Is it in good condition and it looks like it's been taken care of or is it damaged and possibly stolen? If there's no charger included, this is a red flag. If there's something that wasn't disclosed that's a little bit off with the computer, you can still negotiate for an extra 50 to 100 bucks off or you can always walk away. There are more deals out there and it's not worth buying something that you might lose money on or you might not be able to sell. If you have a question about a MacBook that you see online, drop a comment here with the link and I'll check it out and let you know what I think. Now that you know the MacBook passes inspection, let's close the deal and flip it for a profit. If you want to join an amazing community of others flipping their way to freedom just like you, I've got a free Facebook group where we share our best tips, wins, success stories, answer any questions. If you like this video, please let me know by smashing that like button, commenting, hitting subscribe, and sharing it with all of your friends. Peace.